Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Valheim. Just under cover of rain. My gosh, you got to be kidding me, dude. Just the instant, the second I hit record, I slept overnight. <laughs> oh, man. Anyway, welcome back in. Like I said, thank you so much for being here. I appreciate you guys spending your time with me. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm having a great day. In today's video, we're going to come down here. Now, check this out on the map. Uh, been doing a lot of things off camera. We died right there. Just went ahead and removed that marker. We started over here. We came in this way. Home is right here. I have since walked the entirety of the shore all the way around. I've almost made it all the way around this entire uh, island. I don't know if if it continues all the way this way. I'm not, uh, you know, I'm not sure how the islands are. They're all procedurally generated, but I've made my way all the way up here in search of certain cores. So the problem is uh, down in ye olde terrible cave right here where we are about to go. There are uh skeletons like bad skeletons not good ones not not mediocre ones like terribly bad ones so um what we want to do is make all the arrows we can we're running with the plubby old wood arrows it's not the best but it kind of is what it is right now i'm not entirely sure what all uh stuff we're gonna need like this troll hide i know we can make armor with that i'm not entirely sure what we do with the ancient seeds or the gray dwarf eyes i'm pretty sure we use those for uh recipes and whatnot uh, i was kind of looking at fire arrows right here it requires feathers which we don't have but we have all of the resin and some of the wood we can get more wood but we don't have the feathers so it is what it is we're going in with zero flint zero everything just what is it 20 <laughs> 22 wood arrows but let's go in you guys we need these certain cores because today's episode i want to make my way back uh over this way back to home and i want to make the uh let's see what is it crafting this guy right here the charcoal kiln because in the last video we took out the demon deer ichthyr and we got the uh the pickaxe i've been using said pickaxe to go around and get tin i have since made the smelter i think i showed that in the end of the last video uh but we have it we have that thing entirely packed full of tin but i needed to burn it off and the bottleneck is coal so i'm thinking if we make a charcoal kiln this is going to uh, allow us to, I think, put wood in there and it converts it into uh, charcoal. I, I, I'm hoping that's the case, but regardless, we just need some more certling cores to get it done. And this guy is terrible right here. There's some big green skeleton guy you can't see. Right. Right there. There he is. There he is. And... Yeah. He's like some magic guy and we're out of, out of stammies. And he hurts like crazy. Let's go ahead and ichthyr it up while we get hurt. This is going to help our, with our stamina. Oh, God. Oh, God. Now, I don't think they actually can come up here. Oh, my God. You've got to... <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just right away. We're dead. Nice. And it's a good thing we rested right here because this is what, you know, it, it's... You got to plan it. You got to plan it. So I'm going to run in here real quick. If we can take out that archer guy, we should be okay because uh, he can hit us. But I don't think the big green guy of, of gooeyness, he can actually come up here. So if we can take out, uh, let's go six, seven, eight. Yeah, if we can take this guy, this archer guy out, we should be okay. I know you guys can't see a thing. I'm really sorry. Come here, buddy. Yoo-hoo. We're just using all of our stamina. Let's let let's let that regain just a little bit. There we go. And surprise! Rip. So if we come up here. He can't get up. He can't come up and get us, right? Yeah, he cannot. So as long as that archer guy is out of the way, we can just kind of cheese this guy. Like all the cheese. If we can hit the guy, <laughs> we'll be better off. Oh, he's mad at the door all of a sudden. Okay, okay, cool, cool, cool. So, um, right before recording, I went ahead and... Oh, with the mad jukes though, bro. I went ahead and grabbed one certling core. So we have one certling core already. Now, that guy is gone. We can come here, grab all of the bones because we use those for upgrading. I'm pretty sure there was a certling core right there. I went ahead and grabbed it. Goodness gracious! All right, and then we're just gonna we're just gonna die because those archers are straight up freaking legit, dude. Oh my god! I'm gonna take this guy out. There's one more in there. It's all strategery. 
Uh, we... Okay. Here's what happened. We ran out of honey. Which was our tertiary food. We don't have a tertiary food. Ew. Can we eat these guys? No. Yeah, so we only, we only have two different foods, which aren't really buffing us that good. Oh, God. Oh, thread the needle, baby. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what he's shooting at. Oh, he's <laughs> okay. <laughs> Confirmed. I know what he's shooting at. All right, let's just jump in here real quick before the sun goes down. Uh, it's raining still. We could like build a... Uh, a roof over that fire so it will always run so we can just sleep the night away if we need to but right now i feel like we're doing i mean we're we're doing okay we're at least sheltered uh everything is broken and not everything is doing great but we're we're okay ish we need six seven we get our food going get our our health boost going uh and then right here oh that is a spawner right there so we're going to be here indefinitely until the spotter gets taken out. Right. That is not good. We're out of arrows as well. So let's just come on out. We need to run in there. Crap, dude. We got to beeline it in there. Uh, okay. So the whole goal of the episode was to get uh, certling cores so we can make a charcoal kiln. The problem with that is I had to... <laughs> I mean, you saw the map. I had to run... All the way across the map just to find one of these burial places. I've been searching for hours in real life. Maybe an hour. Not hours, but maybe an hour. It's been a while. And uh, finally just found one. So these Sterling cores, dude, they are not easy to find. They are a precious commodity. Of course, this little shark wants to go. Just leave me alone, dude. Oh, the frames. This is a one-star gray door. Just get for controlled. There's some mushrooms right here. We can uh we can use these guys for Frick off! Number eight for a little uh third third boost right there. What is this? Stone? <laughs> Dude, get out of here, you little turd nugget! Is it a problem with being in the uh, in the dark forest? In the black forest? Can't sleep here? Oh, no. I don't want to sleep. I want to do this. I just want to repair everything and make more... More arrows! Inventory full? Come on, bro. Oh, my God. But uh, I hope you guys are doing fantastic today. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I really appreciate you being here with me in another one. And uh, so you guys had mentioned down there that you wanted to see more of this. Bone fragments were taking it. And uh, it kind of surprised me. I was like, okay, well, let, let's do more of it then. So we need to come in here, maybe with a torch. If we can run straight in here. Son of a... Yeah, he, they're going to wreck our freaking face, dude. Just die? Now, if we can immediately come in here and take this thing out before it spawns. Yes! Okay, we can die now. It doesn't matter. We got the spawning out. Look at that! There's certainly cores up there for days. Yes. Okay, we are okay. We are okay. Ish. <laughs> it's still raining. <laughs> Welcome to the Goodish Death episode. Where everything is absolutely terrible. We need to come here real quick. Right here. Right there. Right there. Just grab this. Give me up. It's a freaking two-star... Young man, let's come over this way since the, uh, let's see, six, seven, eight. Uh, since the spawn is gone, then, uh, we can just cheese this guy right here. If he kills us, then we just come right in the entrance and get him back. Which, which way are you going there, bud? Stand still. I can't see anything. It's so funny. It's like they get mad at the door. They're like, this stupid door, not on my watch. Dude, I can't see a th I have no idea where this guy is. I can't see a thing. All right, stammies. There we go. Stammies and... Not too bad, you guys. Not too bad. We're taking out a two-star skelly with a plubby old longbow and wood arrows. 
swing and a miss. Right there. Okay, we got him. We got him. <laughs> and this is today's episode. Brought to you by Wood Arrows. Oh, God. Oh, God. I thought he was going to hit me. Oh, that scared me. That made me pucker, dude. I think we keep shooting right over his shoulder. The problem with skeletons, nailed it, is uh, you can shoot an arrow at him and it like goes like right through the rib cage. That's a thing. Trust me. Trust me. It's a thing. Okay. Is this? That's stone. We dropped that for sure. We wanted to do that. This was a stupid place. <sighs> Certainly, course. Rubies. We have rubies already right here. So we should be able to pick that up. Coins. We have coins already. So we should be able to pick that up. More coins. Coins for days. Certainly, cores. I really need more of these things. And this. Bam. A chest. Some chesticles. Noise. We need to repair this stuff too. I don't know if we can do that. Oh, there's certainly core right there, dude. Now, I think we needed... Uh, <laughs> I was about to say something. I don't even think I finished my sentence. It doesn't matter. We need five certainly cores. We have three. And I think we have two at the base. But just... I don't want to make it all the way back to base. Just to be like, oh, crap. We're short too. You know what I'm saying? So what we're going to do is we're going to come this way. Uh, there's actually two doors here. Let's do this. Let's see if these guys want to go. See, there's some right here. There's just a free, a free certling core right there. Why would you not do that? And the bones, bones are made for upgrading stuff. I don't think we've actually upgraded a single thing just yet. Uh, let's see, nothing back here. Noise, noise. This is huge, you guys. We're gonna be able to go back there. And there, I mean by there, I mean back back to base and actually make a charcoal kiln. Um, our this is almost gone. Our torch. I'm actually amazed there's not more bad guys here. Let's let's save the torch. Save the torch. <gasps> Flint head arrows. You are majestical. We're gonna do that. Flint head arrows. Nice. We're gonna set those as active. My wood is just laying on the ground. So that's it. Oh no 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 no. That's not it. It sounds like there's another spawner, doesn't it? Like the sounds in this game are terrifying. Yeah, there's nothing. So we actually have a total of four, of four certling cores. If we get back there and I find out I actually don't even have one and we need five. Oh, I'm going to I'm probably going to quit playing the game forever. Let's do this. <laughs> seen better days, that's for sure. Yeah, so a little bit of copper. Oh, I should tell you guys too. Um, while my torch burns out, let me show you here real quick. I've been doing uh, I've been finding all these copper nodes all over the black force so we, we copper is not an issue anymore um not that it ever was to begin with let's see we need to head back this way back to base yeah because we had we found 10 right and we got the uh i said q is auto walk we got this guy the antler pickaxe so the pickaxe wasn't an issue we found all the 10 we found like or the big issue was that you guys didn't see because i've been dealing with it off camera was the uh oh what is this oh wow uh, was the bottleneck of not enough charcoal so this is gonna fix it oh that's right the snow biome you guys we found snow right here i'm actually gonna leave all that stuff alone we're just gonna beeline it straight back to base and i'll see you guys here in about 12 hours uh by the time i get back over here we probably could just cut straight across and we're back in our beautiful majestical little valley our little field i love it and it looks like most of these trees have grown back there's deer. I also, I've, I've also been uh, <laughs> trying to find out words, but I've also been working on my base as well. A little bit off camera. Uh, so what we've done over here, I think I showed you guys this already. We built these uh, stabilizer columns right here that don't really stabilize anything. We left our door open like bosses. But also right here, uh, this guy has been here. The overhang protects it for when it rains. It stays on at all times. Um, little campfire right there. And then also, I, I think I showed you guys this, but I don't think I've shown you guys this. We made this bigger. The wall used to go right here. You can see the beams down there. I went, since added this on, and this is like probably the best deck ever. It's, it's definitely better than the deck I made in the last scum video. That's for sure. <laughs> yeah. So I don't know. It is what it is. I need to go ahead and like bring the roof out just a little bit more to, to protect this. So we don't have to, uh repair it every single time we're, we're doing things it doesn't cost anything to repair 
as we've learned. So it's not a huge deal, but it, it is kind of pain in the old nutskies to, to run around and have to repair all this stuff all the time. So let us sleep real, real quick. Set our spawn that we're back here at home. Actually, can't show you the map while sleeping. Just a second. In the valley of the jolly creatures. Okay, set spawn right here. We are bam, back here. Home. Day 29 of all days. So let's go ahead and start putting some of this stuff away. Certainly cores. Definitely need to stick those guys in there. Um, hmm. Get some of that resin put away. We have more chesticles over here. I'm just trying to look. Yeah, we got some copper. Here's some of our tin. There we go. Just trying to use use the old eyeballs to see what needs to go where. We at some point I need to actually put a little bit of effort into my chests. And we have three. Okay, so we have seven total. So perfect. Nailed it. We have enough certling cores to make the charcoal thing. So if we repair this, it repaired all of our uh what is this? Our tunic and all leather, like butt cloth and loin cloth and crotchal region stuff um we also have these skulls now i remember remember taking out ichthyr we needed uh three of the antler heads the trophies i don't know what it takes to summon the other bosses so i'm kind of holding on to those things just in case i don't really know um then we need to find these guys we have three of these skeleton trophies yeah not a clue if we need those or not rubies we'll go ahead and put those away that goes right there we also have the gray dwarf Brute and the Shaman trophies as well. And I can't even believe that we're going to need... Yeah, we need we need more chesticles right now. Holy cow, dude. But first things first. When you come out here, under cover of, of daytime, grab one charcoal and then right here. See? Charcoal. <laughs> one of 20. That is the bottleneck. This, there's seven tin in here that we haven't been able to burn out yet because we don't have the charcoal to do so. So... What we want to do is get this bad boy online. So we need 20 stone, five certling cores. Let us grab the 20 stone right now. Right click on this guy. We can probably just take this stone out if I were to guess. That's going to give us some stone. I don't know what level of um, pickaxe we have right now. Like as far as my skill level goes. We're using a plubby old antler pickaxe from Ichthyr, the demon deer. See, that's five stone. Okay, not yet. We need 20. I actually think we can check it here in just a second. There's four stones. So over... Not trophies. Here. We're 13, which actually isn't too bad. That's high, uh, way higher than I thought. Let's take this guy out. And, uh... Oh, we got some stone right there, dude. Grabbing the stone increases our pickaxes now we are level 14 nice so that way when it comes time to getting a better pickaxe which i'm hoping is uh i'm hoping that we get the better pickaxe when we hit the copper age the copper age i don't think there's a tin age i think you can mix tin with copper and make bronze to do like a bronze age i don't think there's an actual tin age i think it was just like i i don't remember if tin gave us anything <laughs> i think uh, a bar of pure tin ready to be worked can't be teleported uh, indicated by a little icon right there so we needed 20 stone we got 41 we're good to go let's come right here and let's go right here and this guy is massive holy cow all right let's just place it right there this guy wants to go for whatever reason a little shart get shooted now right here charcoal kiln you don't have any processable items. I'm assuming they mean wood. Let us test it. We have dose wood. Two wood in our inventory if we do that. Yeah, it puts two in there. The wood's gone. So obviously it is wood that fuels this bad boy. So if this can spit out charcoal, then we can run over it and then poop it in here to burn off the rest of this tin. Because I think once you add stuff in there, I don't think... Yeah, look at that. <laughs> a little, oh, it's a little cold turd. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, we're back in business. Uh, I don't think we can remove items uh, that we've already placed in there. And the bees are not obnoxious at all. So somewhere over here, we had copper. 
the oldie copper that I grabbed from out in the world. There's 20 copper. Oh, we're heavy. I actually put a door right here. Don't know why I'm running around. <laughs> nice. Go ahead and E that. E that. Now, can we mix things? I guess is what I'm wondering. Can we mix? Yeah, we can. We can. We can mix copper with tin. Now, is that going to spit out bronze? We haven't learned bronze. There's not a... Like, there's nothing I'm aware of that shows us... Uh, oh, God. We are we are encumbered like crazy. Just going to drop all the copper on the ground. There's nothing that shows us, like, a, a recipe, right? Actually, I I don't want to just drop <laughs> drop all of our copper on the ground. That's a dumb idea. We can come here. Let's place it uh, back right there. Bam. Put our tin right there. Rocks, put it right there. We don't need any more rocks. Rocks, who needs them? Let's come out here. Let's grab a like all the wood. Just a little bit more. Get freaking owned, dude. Oh. <laughs> dude, the bow is trash. There's got to be a better a better solution eventually. All right, here we go. So in today's episode, I mean, we've done a lot of stuff already. I've done more stuff because I've been editing things, but I really want to just see what, what we can get. Bro, that was so loud. I want to see what all we can get by entering into the copper stage. I keep saying that, <laughs> but we shall see. <laughs> So I think if we put that right there, we can we can keep wood in here to just always kind of grab it, always fill it up, and then uh, maybe even charcoal too, once we get further on down the road. Smelt 10 of 10. There we go. Keep it going. This stuff takes forever. I don't know if there's like upgrades or better uh, smelters we can get, but my goodness, dude, it takes forever in a day <laughs> for this stuff to smelt up. Uh, while we're here, I guess, let's grab 10, maybe three right here. Building this little guy. Can we just do that? We sure can. Very, very nice. Okay, cool. Uh, and over here, come out here, place that there. Stick that guy back in there. What do we got? Still burning through the tin. Okay, nice. <laughs> it's just a busy box. <laughs> It takes forever, though, you guys. Like, forever, ever. Coal. Two. Oh, what is this? What is this? Oh, that's still 10. It didn't look like 10, but it's 10. There you go. Three. We seem to just always be making one right as one burns over here. Three. It'll go. Two. Uh, no, yeah, see? Right there. And then three. Yeah. Nice. Cool. What are you? <laughs> Still 10. Boop. I'm going to throw some wood over here too. Just to, or wood. My gosh. Some food over here. Just let it burn a little bit. To kind of expedite the thing. We probably could make another one of these bad boys. If we had the certling cores for it. And another one of these. Just to double up on production. But it is what it is right now. Like we're, we are down to two certling cores. Uh, on this much of the map. That's all I found. It was like. Uh, I mean, I found like maybe 15 of them, but we've used them to build this and this. We still don't have enough. We don't have enough to double up on stuff right now. <gasps> Copper. We did it. We did it. New building piece of forge. Wait a second. It just, it just ran right past the screen real quick. What did, we have one copper, one copper. Okay. What did we learn? We learned friendly fire. No, not friendly fire. What? Does not show us doesn't show us anything. <laughs> Hold on. All right, we learned um a new thing. Let's see what else we learned here. Tankard. 
No, I don't think that's new. Troll leather. Yeah, we can make that stuff. Uh, three? Crafting? Oh, look at this. Look at this. There's different stuff here. What is this guy? Forge! The forge! <gasps> Missing requirements. We need four coal. Oh, six copper. Oh, let's do that. Let's do that before before today's video is over. Let's get that knocked out. We need... Apparently, we need the stone. We need to hold on to this. Hold on to this. Hold on to this. Oh, crap, dude. So, we need more copper. That's two. We need six. Um, let's just, let's just feed it. <laughs> it takes so much wood. <laughs> Holy cow. All right, there we go. Oh yeah, baby. We got four charcoal, eight stone and boom. Nailed it. Let's check it. Um, six copper. We're carrying too much. Let's go ahead and stick that right there. That right there. Perfect. Perfect. Now three. We come right here. This is the forge. Missing requirements. Oh crap. We need 10 wood. Okay. All right. Hold. Hold please. We'll go 10. Beep. Beep. Perfect. Three. Nailed it. Right there. Epic. Look at this. Bronze. Yeah. We can craft bronze now. Um, A cauldron. A sconce too far okay okay bronze bronze check this out it takes two copper and one tin i was right then we can make the butcher knife and the copper knife or times five for that that's a little strange so we need to just be smelting up all of the the tin and the copper so we are actually going to need more tin uh let's see this there we go nice nice so we can stick we can stick the coal in here. So yeah, confirmed. We need all the wood. How much wood? All of it. All the copper. All the everything. We got four more left. It's a good thing on the map. Uh, it's a good thing I've started marking off all these copper places. Every time I came across copper, I was like, copper. So right here, you guys, there's one, two. <laughs> there's a couple deaths. We don't need <laughs> one, two, three. Four, five, six, and these are all like big nodes. And then about 32,000 deaths up here. This is where we started the episode off out there. Nice. Nice. Okay. Yeah, we definitely need uh, more more of everything. A, right here. Maybe we can make some tin right now. And just to like unlock stuff. Let's, or bronze, I said. There's two copper. Now oh, what? There we go. Okay. Nice. Right there, we can make one copper just to unlock. Or bronze, I said. Just to unlock whatever it is. Ready? Three. Go. Ooh. A curious. Uh, uh, a bronze axe. Oh, bronze nails. Helmet. A bronze pickaxe. Yes. Yes. We're in the bronze age, you guys. Confirmed. We are in the bronze age. Look at this. So we have bronze armor. Um, pickaxe, pickaxe, right here. We're gonna need ten bronze and core wood. We just so happen to have the core wood, so that's not a big issue. But yeah, you guys, we did it. We are officially in the bronze age. Wow. Uh, so I wanted to look here real quick. The fine wood bow. We are currently level two on it. We need ten fine wood, ten core, and then four deer. I don't know if we actually have that or not. If we don't have it now, that's something I can go do off camera. But I keep forgetting that we can upgrade our stuff. So there's there's fine wood. We actually do have it. But do we have deer? How many deer, deer do we have? I don't know. None? Are you farkling kidding me? And we, ha we have some, right? We have to. Yeah, right here. Okay, we do. Nice. So we can upgrade our bow. Upgrade over here. Our flintwood bow. Oh, we need level three. A tier three workbench, which... Uh, do we make that over here? I don't really know, like, what's, what's level three now. Maybe... 
A tanning rack. This guy? Bronze? Probably one of these guys. Yeah. Yeah. Im forge improvement. Oh, workbench improvement. Yeah, three bronze. It's just ten fine wood bow and three bronze. Do we have more fine wood bow? I think we used some, right? Well, I mean, we have it. We just haven't used it yet to upgrade our our bow just yet. I think I saw right here. Yeah, so there's 19. So we're going to be shy. How much? Upgrade this. Fine wood bow. It takes 10. And then to craft this. It takes 10. So we're going to be shy one. So we can do one, but not the other right now, just because I'm out of time. There's one bronze. Okay. All right. Well, you guys, that is probably going to do it for today. I really appreciate you guys spending your time with me and hanging out. And uh, super duper excited. There's one random torch in there. To be in a new, a new age, a bronze age of all things. It's amazing, you guys. <laughs> Our charcoal is rolling downhill. That's no bueno. Right there. Uh, tin. We have it. We have it. There's two of that. We can make one more bronze. It's going to take us forever and a day. Let's see, what, what was it? Right here? No, right here. Yeah, it's going to take us forever to make this stuff. All the, the bronze needed. <laughs> Good lord. Yeah, so that's going to do it for today, you guys. I really appreciate you. Like I said, I really appreciate you guys hanging out and spending your time with me. I love you guys. Hope you have a wonderful rest of your week. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Good morning. I want to check something real quick. It sounded like everything just like mass produced overnight. It sure did. Oh, that's huge. So when you sleep, it, it, it keeps things going all night like if it was real time. Oh, I love that. Nice. Okay. We'll see you guys in the next one. <laughs>